Hello, 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 hello everybody, and this is of course Great and Glorious, seem to be famous one day, Nick Dutch back again for a delightful 40 servants reading, three card reading coming right up, going out generally to anyone who's watching this right now, it might be good, it might be bad, I don't know either, uh, we'll have to see what comes on through, right, now, um, let me tell you a bit more about myself. I am here to be your professional online street performer today. If you like the work I'm doing, and if you value uh, the contribution I'm making to the YouTube community and the YouTube, YouTube visual space, and also to help you with your contemplations, thoughts, and feelings about life, then show your appreciation with a thumbs up. Show your appreciation through subscribing and rating, commenting, favoriting, sharing, and all the other fun things you can do. Add me to a playlist if you want. I don't mind. Uh, and also, don't forget, I have the super thanks button out there at the moment, so that you can click on it and chip me, a, chip me a couple of quid or a couple of dollars if you see fit, and you can afford to do so by the end of payday if you value the quantity and quality of content I'm putting out. If you missed some of the other videos I've uploaded recently, then click on my channel name and go to the video section and you will see them all. So, and also use the search facility there so that you can view what else is out there. Three cards. All of them reversed this time. Okay, so the meaning, therefore, it's not a backward meaning. It's somehow contorted. It's somehow not quite right. It's somehow saying that the, as it were, the literal meaning of the symbols is different. And then trying to find a way of applying that to your existence. So your contemplations about life then hopefully moves forward. Okay? The first one, the gatekeeper. Right, you would assume that the gatekeeper would be a character who is on your side, beneficial. Okay, here's the door, I'll open it for you. Come on, come right in. You know, that kind of, that's the way it would come over to me. But it's reversed. So it seems like someone is possibly developing some pleasure from restricting your ability to do the next right thing. So the questioning you've got to do, the self-questioning, is about am I really doing the next right thing and does this person who is a block and an obstacle in my way actually like, have my best interests at heart uh, through stopping me from doing something or should I be stopping them from stopping me? Okay, it's up to you to work out which way round it is, taking into account the situation and circumstances. Then the sun, the source of all our power, according to the Monty Python song. All right. Obviously, it isn't. There's also, there's also geothermal. There's also um, you know various forms of radiation from space, and, and so on and so forth. But allegorically, the sun is therefore the source of all our power. But it's also reversed. Why is it reversed? Something is stopping you from getting fulfilled. My general feeling is that the person or situation or institution that is blocking your way thinks they're doing what's right for you but in doing so they're stopping you from getting the fullness of, uh, of something the fullness of the spirits, fullness of the uh, financial benefits you can get from something, fullness of something just like something is missing, you want to move forward in life but maybe there's a way of working around the obstacle, working around your gatekeeper and finding a solution to your problems. Again, a sign of contemplation coming on out there. The moon reverse. In this particular case, are you feeling bad or sad or unhappy because you're not getting to where you want to go? Are you feeling that even your perceptions about how to move forward are being affected by other messages um, you've received? Right? What contemplations could you do about other ways to get past your blocks and obstacles so that you can then get the warmth which you require, the nourishment, the, the feeling of being on top of things? Just a quick contemplation for you today. Rate, comment, subscribe, favorite, share, uh, click the bell, click the bell, the bell is good. Leave me any comments down there as to whether you like this reading, whether you don't like this reading, whether it's relevant to you, whether it's not, I don't know but I'm here for you, okay? And that's your reading for today. Keep tuned, and more fun will be coming. Not just readings, also other fun stuff, especially around the famous, fantastic, scary, spooky, fantastic Halloween time in which I will be doing something interesting for you people. Speak to you in a bit. Bye for now.